What is up guys, it's your boy Sliding here and welcome back to another video and in today's video we are back playing Subnautica. I haven't touched this game since I left to go on summer break and it feels good to be back. I wanted to finish this series because I didn't want to leave it. I know that we started a Minecraft world that got corrupted. I couldn't play it no more so I might start a new Minecraft world. Who knows if you guys want me to please tell me down in the comment section but if we go here to play. I haven't played since April 3rd, 2022. That was at least like four months ago, I think. So we're going to get back into this world. If you guys do enjoy this video, please hit that like button and subscribe today. See more videos like this. Comment down below what y'all think about today's video after you get done watching it. And let's get right into the video. Our game. I'm a little bit lagging. Oh my gosh, dude. It feels so much good. Like, it's so much better to be back. So it looks like we have another broadcast as I left. Um... I don't know. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. Should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Alright, so I guess Sunbeam's finally coming to get us? Oh my lord, dude. Oh, there's my Seamoth. There might have been... Okay, so when I left, because I did record another video before I left. Um, I did, yes, I did record a video. I don't know what I did, so I can't really, like, help you guys if there's something new, something you guys don't remember. But just to let you know, if you guys see something different, I telling you now I did record so apparently sunbeams coming to get us and that is the sunbeam landing site and that means there's land if I do remember that does means there's that does mean there is land so so it is over there so we have 38 minutes until we go there so let's let's get some things sorted out and if I do remember, I think we did go to the Aurora. You guys didn't probably didn't see that, but we did go to the Aurora, I think. So we have a lot of materials here. And we have a lot of water. Can I make a couple more batteries? Dude, it just it just coming back to this game feels just completely new to me. Cause I know a lot of people who play this game get a fear of the sea, and it's like, oh my gosh. It's so, like, just creepy. And how, wait, how did I get this knife? So right now we have 36 minutes to get to the landing spot. I don't know how far it is, so I should probably should take that into consideration. Maybe we should start heading over there. I want to free up my inventory a little bit. Get rid of the quartz and the lead. It's starting to get dark, too. I don't like that. It's all the way over there. I don't want to go to the map while it's dark. So what we're going to do is, since it's getting dark, we're just going to, uh, my editing, editing me is going to just swipe to daytime before we leave. Alright guys, so it is sunrise right now. Um, we got, I got a couple of things while you guys kind of just jump forward. I got some food, I got some, um, more, ba I got like one more battery. And right now we still have 29 minutes left, so I might, might as well just start making our way over there. First, I gotta cook the food that I did get because I didn't want it to go bad while I was on the trip of being rescued. So we're gonna cook this food real quick. Ooh, we need a repair tool, actually. Now that I think about it, we do need a repair tool because as y'all can see, we our Seamoth is at 38 health. All right, so our sea moth is up to 100%, so I'm just going to rearrange some things. Scanner. I still have my survival knife. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's all I need right now. So let's head over there. I don't know if this is going to be like a... I don't know if this is going to be scary or not. Because everything in this game is scary. There's just floating just scrap metal. Can't I like up the speed on this? 
I forgot the controls on the Seamoth. That is a thing that I probably did get bef uh, the last time I played, is the depth. I increased the depth of where the Seamoth can go. There's one of those things. See, now now, the, now it's starting to get deeper, and I don't like that. We go up to the top, we are... Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this it? Is this the island? See, now the bottom's starting to get deeper. I don't like that. I think this is the place. <gasps> we got another uh, transmission. See, I don't want to go down there, bro. That looks scary. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Oh my god, I think this is the place. How far? Massive energy signature in the region. Cannot identify. Cannot identify. The heck? Oh, there's spiders here. I remember these. Oh yeah, I remember these. These are the things that were on the Aurora when I did go. Whoa, what is that place? Some salt here. I can get that for water. What is this? Bumbleow tree. Oh, I got some. I can consume this? Oh, lit. Give me more. I want it all. I'm eating this. It says this is the landing site right here, but they're not here for 23 minutes. So we can go explore a little bit. What is this place? This looks like alien technology. I'm not even going to lie. Let me keep my map up. Whoa, what is this? Maybe I should scan it. Purple table fragment. Okay. Force field control. Let's scan this. Insert tablet. I don't have the tablet. Wait, don't I have the broken pieces? Oh, no. Alright, so this looks like to be like some sort of alien base. Can I go up here? Oh, pick up purple tablet. I'm checking it out. Self scan. I haven't done that in a while. Ooh. Self scan complete. Foreign bacteria count has reached statistically significant levels. No adverse effects detected. Be vigilant for symptoms. So wait, I'm infected. The last time I recorded a video, I do remember that I was perfectly fine, but now I am. F I'm infected. I'm infected with what, though? Since we got the purple tablet, now we can go in here and see what's up. So that lowers the force field. Is there going to be, like, some sort of alien in this place? Scans indicate this structure is composed of a metal alloy with unprecedented integrity. No match is found in database performing structural analysis. Okay, so this is some type of alien base, I'm guessing. What is that? I got an achievement. Wow. What is this? Discovered inside an alien facility? It says that we can't translate it. That's weird. What was that called? Uh, so we have to go to the lower section, but what is it, that thing I just got called? An ion cube. Analysis of the patterns on the walls cannot ascertain whether their purpose is aesthetic or functional. Further data required. Further data required. So we have some. Oh, there's another ion cube. So we have some data right here. Let's collect that. Whoa, is this just one, like an elevator of some sort? I, th I thought I was about to fall, like I accidentally fell down. That's what I got scared of. <laughs> Whoa, hold on, can we go in here? Don't tell me there's something in here. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. 100 meters, eh? Wait, what is that? Is that like connected to the base? Might have to go check that out. 
But I am not trying to get killed because I think I hear Leviathan Reaper. I don't want to know. Oh, oh, I, oh, I think we got another broadcast. That's Life Pod 13. I'm going to turn that off real quick. 12. We'll have to go look at those at another time, but right now we are at this base. This place is creepy, bro. I don't want something popping out and just, just ugh. Alien rifle? No shot. Can I make an alien rifle? So right now we have 17 minutes left. And we are just exploring this alien base. I currently don't know what is in this place. I'm still hoping that nothing pops out. I found another purple tablet. I can't believe people like speed run this game. There's like so much. What is this? Alien device? Oh, it's moving. Doomsday device. Scans indicate this device contains enough potential energy to destroy the entire planet along with the most of the solar system. Fortunately, it has a malfunction. Oh my gosh. God, thank you. Okay, I think we use that purple tablet to unlock this thing right here. Alright. I don't want to touch anything and get, like, vaporized. Like, I don't want to touch that door and get vaporized like Star Wars. So I don't see anything in here. No, nothing but, like, oh. I think we go over here. Interact. What is this thing? The control panel is broadcasting a energy core. Translation reads Warning Infected individuals may not disable the weapon. This planet is under quarantine. Under quarantine? Is this America 20, 2020? Okay, we'll look at we'll look at the location later. But from what I'm reading on that is maybe our ship got in range and it shot us down into the planet. So then wait, if Sunbeam gets an oh no. Sunbeam's gonna get destroyed. Oh no! Is there any way for me to contact them? Just be like, don't get in range. So that started moving and it just started buzzing and they should be arriving in just five seconds. Survivor, we see you. Man, I don't know how you held out down there. We broke an atmosphere and we're descending towards the landing site. Is that a building down there? What do you mean you can't identify it? Hold on. No turning back now. Positions, everyone. Touching down in 10, 9, 8. Oh no, no. There's Sunbeam right there. From the building? Change course. Set thrusters to full. No way. What? He's just, they're just gone. Is that it? And then just the debris is just going to fall into the ocean. What? 
No. That was our only way of getting out of here. But I told you. I told you guys that this would happen. What is that the building's just going to stay like that? Or is it going to... Oh. So guys, that's going to be it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe to see more content and more videos on my channel. And if you guys do want to let me know what y'all thought about today's video, I thought it was real just like unraveling the lore. And that's what I love about games. So comment down below what y'all thought about it. And that's going to be it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Later.